Shalom, shalom. Start this lesson first and foremost. I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahushai, Ba'ashem, Akadash. Double honors to our elders, apostles, and great millstone who rule well and push out the 100% truth and truth sincerity. And shalom to the whole four legs scattered across the four winds. The ones this lesson be edifying. You know, hey, topic of this lesson is going to be, you know, I'm, I'm going with it through the spirit, you know. I, I had to read, you know, Sodom and Gomorrah. And, you know, hey, we're living in a, a, a modern day Sodom and Gomorrah, you know. Hey, Revelation 11 and 8 tells you that, you know, Sodom and Egypt. Why do they call it Sodom and Egypt? They call it Sodom because, hey, look what they're practicing out here. You know, look what they're pushing out here. Look what they're pushing on the kids, you know. And Egypt because our people, you know, were in bondage in Egypt. You know, hey. And when you think about it, hey, we're all lots, you know. Hey, we're all vexed with these these conversations that these people will be having. You know, we're, we're vexed with this agenda. You know, Locks was vexed with the people that lived in Sodom and Gomorrah and what they're doing. Just like us, we're vexed with them. You know, we're in that Micah 2 and 10 spirit, you know. We're rising and we're departing from this place. Not physically, but spiritually because we understand that, hey, this place is set to get destroyed. You know, just as Sodom and Gomorrah was destroyed. And the way Sodom and Gomorrah was destroyed was through what? Fire and brimstone. You know, the scriptures tell you that Sodom and Gomorrah was an example to not live ungodly. You know, Sodom and Gomorrah was an example. And hey, look at this place. Look at Babylon. Look at America. This place passed Sodom and Gomorrah. You know, and wickedness and everything. You know, this place is the worst of the worst. Worst of the bunch. There's nothing worse than Babylon. You know? And the, 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 the mindset of these people, hey, they, they, back then, you know, people used to say that they were in the closet, you know, and, you know, now it's to the point, hey, these people are bold with it, man. These people are in the open with it. If you speak out against it, you're getting canceled. If you speak out, you know, against it, you, you may get sanctioned, you know. Hey, man, these are the times that we're living with. They are really trying to push this Sodom the Sodom agenda, you know, they literally have videos of this, them saying we're queer and we're coming for your kids, you know, who, who, who wants to raise children in a society like this, man, you know, I saw the scriptures say they declare their sins as Sodom, they hide it not, these people do not hide it, these people are out in the open with it, they're bold with it, you know, these people are in the spirit of Sodom and Gomorrah. That's the spirit that these people are in. And we're in the spirit, the spirit of Lot. You know, we're tired. We're tired of these people. We're tired of the filthy conversations. You know, that's why we're waiting on Yahweh Shem Yahshai to come and deliver us from this place. To come deliver us from Babylon. Because enough is enough. You know? It's to the point where, hey, you can't even flip through. You can't even scroll through social media. You can't even watch TV. You know, without that happening. You know? Hey, this place gotta get destroyed, man. You know, these people are in the Sodom and Gomorrah spirit, you know. Those same spirits are back here today. You know, and hey. We gotta, you know, hey, gotta cleave onto Yahba Shimmy Al Shai. We gotta trust in the Lord. You know, especially with the things the way things are going, you know, especially with you know what Esau's trying to do, how Esau's trying to demasculate the man. You know, we so we know that's been your agenda the whole time. You know, demasculate the man. It dates all the way back to hey, even the 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 the, the, beat, the serpent and the woman. You know, demasculate the man doing all these things. Come on, man. But hey, we got a power. And our power sees the bullshit that you're doing, Esau. Our power sees what you're pushing on our people, Esau. You know? And you're going to be destroyed. You know? And all those that envy their oppressor and they like his ways and they're down with his agenda, hey, you're going to get destroyed too by that thermonuclear fire. You know, fire is the best cleansing agent. And hey, those people that are down with his agenda, hey, you need to be cleansed. You need to be cleansed. You know, that's how the Lord rained fire and brimstone on Sodom and Gomorrah. Hey, this place is going out through thermonuclear fire. You know, there's intercontinental ballistic missiles, you know, will be shot into America 
and this place will be destroyed. You know? And those people that were down with the society, that did not want to detest, that did not want to adhere to the Lord, that was cool with this agenda, hey, y'all gonna be cleansed through that fire. You know, with that being said, I just want to give all praise on them and glory too. Yahweh and Ba'ashim, Yahushai, Ba'ashim and Kakadash. Double honors to our elders, apostles, a great millstone, rule well, and push out the 100% truth and truth sincerity. And shalom to the whole four legs, scattered across the four winds. The one that's less on Zedifying. Until the next, shalom.